but this is what it uh, what it pops up. So uh, it says right here, remove this. So I click on OK, and then boom, it's gonna restart, and then it's gonna restart, and there you go, you have your Windows. Hey, what is up, guys? So in this video, I'm trying to install Windows 10 to my uh, MacBook Pro, and uh, I think this should work for MacBook Air, iMac, and other uh, computers that uh, runs on uh, macOS. And then um, right now, I'm just trying to uh, install the Windows 10 using the uh, Windows 10 uh, ISO right here. So this is what it uh, what it pops up. So uh, it says right here remove this uh, an error occurred while copying the Windows uh, installation files so with the password and uh, username popping up uh, uh, I'm not gonna enter my password instead I'm just gonna go to cancel right here okay and then just cancel it so open up your disk utility I am in a uh, disk utility right here so uh, on tr uh, these two files we need to get rid of it so uh, to get rid of them um, first thing is to uh, click on this and then uh, go to partition up here. Uh, so for the boot camp, uh, camp right here, and also the eight gigs. Yeah, we wanna get rid of these two. I'm gonna click on the eight gigs, and then I'm gonna click on subtract to get rid of it. And the other one, subtract, just like that. And now I'm gonna have everything back to uh, my Macintosh uh, SSD. So I'm gonna click on apply partition and just wait for it from here. And then it should get rid of uh, those. Yeah, so right now I'm back to normal. So what I need to do is to install a software that allows you to uh, convert the uh, the Windows, the original Windows 10 ISO, so, which is uh, this file. I think you already have it. You gotta convert this into, you know, using this program to convert it to uh, Bootcamp ISO. So the reason why is uh, this file is the latest version of Windows 10, so it is a little too big for uh, the boot camp. So right now, uh, what we need to do is uh, to install the program. And uh, what the program does is it breaks uh, this file into chunks so that uh, the boot camp can run it. So uh, I'm gonna, I already installed it right here. So I'm just gonna open it and uh, install it from there. So when I get to like this screen, it makes me very nervous because uh, you know I always get the failed message. So it should be working with the new uh, ISO. It is saying a uh, copying Windows files. I just wait for it. I hope it's gonna work. 
Go. So right now, I'm gonna enter my password again, and this is the screen when the um, the error message popping up. So right now it doesn't do anything. So I'm gonna click on OK, and then boom, it's gonna restart, and then it's gonna restart to Windows. And there you go, you have your Windows. I'm so excited because being able to use Mac OS and Windows OS is like super nice. That's why I wanted for so long time. Here it is. Okay, uh, it is up to you guys to uh, continue to watch me setting it up, or um, yeah, it's up to you. Oh, by the way, uh, before you leave, uh, make sure to uh, leave a like button if it works for you, and also make sure to uh, comment if you have any questions uh, or any suggestions, and also make sure to subscribe for more videos in the future. Thanks. Choose the one with the boot camp right here. I hope you guys can see it. Oh wow, I can zoom in. Yeah, see? Yeah, with the um, boot camp. It's gonna say boot camp right here. So, right. And then just click on the next. Okay. Okay, thank you guys. Um, I hope you guys like this video. I hope this video helps you guys. If it does, make sure to leave a like button. And if you guys have any more questions or uh, any suggestions, uh, make sure to leave it in the comment section below. And also make sure to uh, subscribe for more. Share this video with your friends. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. Peace out.